All right, my 65 F100 build. I got this from who knows how many owners has <laughs> been working on it already, but it's bagged. It's up in the air right now because I'm working on it. But anyways, three point seat belts I'm installing. Never had seat belts before in this truck. This is the original bench, ugly cover. I'm gonna replace that, obviously. Tank in the back. Um, I have to fab up a bracket for the rear of the bench to mount the um, the receiving points of the seat belts. But at any rate, what I did for now was um, I took a, uh, I believe this is a 3 16 or quarter inch um, piece of angle iron. And it's uh, two inches by two inches. I made it grade eight, you know, bolts and, and hardware and all that jazz with uh, plates underneath the, um, underneath the body for support. And then this is bolted up here. You can see uh, right in here, there's a bolt for the retractor unit itself. It goes up here. And then this part is just a single bolt. Again, this is heavy duty, grade eight. Um, I forgot the thickness of it. It's at least half inch, probably, uh, probably thicker though. I wanna say it might've been closer to three quarter for this guy. They give you it when you order it online, but. Anyway, this is about seven inches or eight inches from the ceiling, and I just happened to mount it here. There was no hole. I drilled a hole, and I have there was access here to run my hand in uh, very carefully and thread it to start it with the um, the nut, and then finish it the rest of the way. I have the other side done already. There's little LED lights there. There we go. So the other side is done already, um, and now my next step, because this bench was also not bolted down, was I had to build a frame to bolt it all down and hold it together, and then um, put in the um, the mounting hardware for the receivers of the seat belts. But that's essentially how I did it. And um, pretty straightforward. It's just fab work and put and bolting it all together with the grade eight bolts. Having a kit with all the grade eight hardware is very helpful, of course.